Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a brand new release 2020-2021 Panini Hoops Basketball 5 box. Random team break number 5, and that's from a fresh case. And this is our last case, ladies and gentlemen. So breaks 5, 6, 7, and 8, that's it. So 6 is already on the site, jazbeescasebreaks.com. If you're watching live, so go and get it. No vet common ship aside from Luka, LeBron, Giannis, Zion, and Ja, and Kobe's if any. Uh, obviously hits, numbered cards will ship, but just veteran commons won't ship. Those will be donated to charity. Big thanks to these folks right here for getting into the action. All 30 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Two and a five. Seven for names and teams. One. Two. And seven and final time. After seven, we've got Eddie down to Anthony. Two and a five, seven times for the teams. One, two, three. And seven and final time. After seven, we've got the Miami Heat down to the Dallas Mavericks. All right, Eddie with the Miami Heat, Ramon with the Trailblazers, Joe Parisi with the Warriors, Sean with the Jazz, Greg with the Pistons, Brian with the Rockets, EA with the Clippers, Sean with the Suns, Brian with the Raptors, Anthony with the Pacers. We've got Pacers, Bucks on right now. Bucks up 60 to 37. About four minutes left in the uh, first half. EA with the Bulls, uh, Alexander with the Magic, Eddie with the Knicks, Austin with the Kings, Nicholas with the T-Wolves, Robert with the Hawks, Jonathan with the Celtics, Robert with the Cel uh, Cavaliers, and my Lakers, Austin with the Wizards. You're a wizard. Uh, Matthew with the Nets, Robert with the Spurs, Steven Olsen with the Bucks, Ryan with the Grizz, Tyler with the Sixers, Anthony with the Pelicans, Matthew with the Hornets, nice, Jarrell with the Thunder, Brennan with the Nuggets, and Anthony with the Dallas Mavericks. Let's sort this by... Let's bring it all on one screen, sort it by column B. And let's box these up really quick. Tyler Spaulding has the Sixers up for trade. All right, let me flip screens here for a second. Oh, and don't forget here, I'll drop this into the chat too. Remember, we're, we all have to, and this is me included, we have to kind of wrap our heads around a new draft class here and what the, and realign our, thoughts onto what the big teams are now. So Tw Timberwolves obviously had the number one pick, Anthony Edwards, Weissman, number two with the Warriors, number three, LaMelo Ball, Charlotte Hornets, uh, so on and so forth. So those, those are the main three guys, plus, uh, you know, Obi Toppin, Halliburton, Quickly, so on and so forth. So NBA draft classes in the chat if you're watching live. Okay, let's pop open this heavy case here and see which five boxes we're going to do. And, th and this is our last case in the personal break side, Instagram Live, at Jaspi's Breaks. They're all sold out too. Crazy. So thanks, everybody. All right, so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so let's take five off of here. Then let's take five off of there. So we got stacks of five, one, two, three, four. So we're gonna select a die. I like that one right there. And we'll go one, two, three, four. If I roll a five or a six, I'll just roll again. And it's four, one, two, three, four. So the far right column, you can see the stack of boxes above my head. These we will save for next time. So let's just, just put some slash marks here. I'm sure we'll run all of those, all of these tonight. They might get mixed up, but that's okay. As long as you see those little slash marks on there, you'll know they're from the same case. All right, so there's the there's the boxes we're gonna do right here. All right, so when we come back, here we'll flip, flip back to this list really quick. When we come back, we're just gonna see if there's any trades and then the break. Stick around, we'll be right back. All right, welcome back. 
some trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done. It's all good. Let's see what happens here. Five box, random team five from a fresh case. 2020, 2021 Panini Hoops Basketball. Thanks, everyone, for getting into the action. We really appreciate it. We got Pacers, Bucks. Bucks are up 66 to 50 on the Pacers with just about just under 25 seconds left in the first half. So they're cruising right now. I realized when we were during the trade window that all of the Holiday Brothers are are uh, on not on the same court at the moment, but they're all together. No family reunion. Justin and Aaron Holiday are on the uh, on the Pacers, and Drew Holiday is on the on the Bucks. I know there's some other basketball games going on here. What's going on elsewhere in the league? Looks like we've got the Sixers up 64-42 on the Hornets at the half. Mavs Hawks just started almost at the end of the first quarter. 23-21 Mavs. I think that's it. We've got Clippers, Cavs later, Wizards, Heat, Knicks, Bulls, Rockets, Thunder. What's our next ESPN game? Oh, Suns, Pelicans. Oh, that should be fun. Suns, Pelicans are the next ESPN game, which we will watch, discuss together. Kumpo, 5 for 5 from the field, 14 points. Pretty good. Does does Giannis Antetokounmpo, ladies and gentlemen, does he develop that outside shot? Or just a credible, a credible jumper? I mean, then he's unstoppable, right? I mean, he's already kind of unstoppable. But even if he can shoot decently. Especially from if he gets a little bit of a three-point shot going. And if Brooke Lopez can learn how to shoot threes. All right, so obviously these rookie cards we're going to set aside right there. Inserts like this will ship. Obviously, that's numbers that, of course, will ship. There's Isaac Okoro, Isaiah Stewart. You know, second-year Zions will ship. Right? John Morant's, too. There's Brooke Lopez. Yeah, he's, he learned how to shoot threes. And, ooh, nice. Rookie Inc., Tyrese Halliburton. Nice. That's what we want to see. Austin with the Kings. Look at that. There you go. Yeah, Oliver's a big Kings fan. He's, he likes what he sees there. You wish it was for him. It's James Wiseman, Kira Lewis Jr. Someone brought up the Rookie of the Year odds. Um, and I think Halliburton was at a pretty, pretty good, pretty good odds. There's James Wiseman for the Golden State Warriors. John, what's going on? I 
like what uh what Precious Chua's been doing too. I watched him play the other night, it was pretty strong. Separating those rookies there. And here's a Tyrese Halliburton rookie card. So the auto and a rookie card, I'm sure there'll be a number of these throughout the break. Might want to consider grading some of these too. If he's grayed out nicely and if he ends up having a, a rookie of the year caliber season. I mean, Sacramento's likely going to be in the playoffs, right? They should be in the playoffs. So he might be able to show out in the playoffs as well. There's LaMelo, Charlotte, Matthew Shira. Jones, Emmanuel quickly, I think, has been playing some good basketball, too. New York Knicks, Eddie Romero with the Knicks. And we'll do a recap at the end, too. There's Anthony Edwards and Sadiq Bey. There's Tyler Bay, no relation, at least. None that I saw over some quick internet research. Edwards, of course, number one overall pick, going to the Timberwolves. Nicholas Via Senior. Nice. It's Cole Anthony. Killian Hayes, Aaron Naismith. And we got Elijah Hughes, Hot Signatures Rookie. And that is for the Jazz, Sean Maddock with the Jazz. I think Elijah was there. Where was Elijah drafted? I thought he was drafted a little bit higher than that. He's, he's uh, 39th overall. Oh, it was a Pelicans pick from Washington via Milwaukee, and then that was uh, eventually traded to Utah. Alright, so that was our first box. There's Obi Toppin with Eddie Romero getting the Knicks player. And box two. All right, good luck, everybody. See, so let's see what this where the standings are at after what we've played about a little over twenty games for most teams. Most teams have over twenty games. Sixers are two games ahead of the Brooklyn Nets. The Bucks are two and a half games behind the, behind the Sixers. Celtics, so it's a little, it's a little crammed. It's still crammed to there. Still early in the season. Only twenty some odd games in. Sixers, Nets, Bucks, Celtics are the first four, and then the next four seeds are the Pacers, Hawks, Cavs, Hornets, and we got Toronto, Chicago, even New York on the outside looking in. I guess even the even the magic and the heat, the heat are are only seven and thirteen. They're gonna heat up at some point, I I would imagine. Kind of a rough that's a weird start for them. Pistons are five and sixteen, wizards are four and thirteen. I'm not I don't know if they're gonna be really climbing up the, the ranks, but but in the east anyone can still get a playoff spot. Right now, outside looking in, Raptors, Bulls, Knicks, Magic Heat. What would be ha hashtag good for the hobby would be the New York Knicks getting a playoff spot. 
I guess Charlotte saying in that eighth seed would be nice too. Seeing Lamelo in the playoffs would be good. Increase his stock. But after that, yeah, I would love to see the New York Knicks get an eighth seed. You know, we can see Obi Toppin quickly. And then last year's RJ Barrett in the playoffs doing work. Ooh. When's the last time the Knicks have even been in the playoffs? How long has it been since the Knicks has, since the Knicks have been in the playoffs? New York, see if New York would go nuts. Is that a woo, hot signature Steph Curry? Wow. You really should not be expecting autographs of this caliber out of hoops. They're very few and far between. Golden State Warriors, Joe Parisi. Warriors come out to play. Pretty nice. I set that aside for picture time. It's James Weissman. Also for the Warriors. Nice one, Joe. Steph Curry Auto, James Weissman. Team saying the checklist has a lot of curry autos. Well, so maybe the sneaky good way to get some curry autos then. So there's Tyrese Halliburton, purple parallel. I like that. It matches the little color match going on here. It matches the color of the team. Kings again, Austin. He he was he was about to trade those Kings. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Another quickly for the Knicks, Eddie. Anthony Edwards. Another Anthony Edwards for Nicholas and the T-Wolves. And another warrior, Alan Samalyic. Hoopside autograph. Another one for Joe. This is a warrior's box here. No, no one no one's impressed by the Steph Curry autograph. Only Team Pro has made any sort of comment. Everyone's just like, meh, Steph, whatever. Are there six different curry autos in this set? I can't imagine there's a very many, though, like quantity-wise, of those six. No, no, no one likes Steph Curry autograph anymore. That dropping Skylar Mays there. A 
There's Halliburton again. Three boxes to go. Next box. What about the West? Western Conference. We looked at looked at the Eastern Conference in the last box. Western Conference. We got the top four: Jazz, Clippers, Lakers, Nuggets. Jazz, Clippers, and Lakers all with 16 wins. Jazz has five losses. Clippers and Lakers both are exactly the same: 16 and six. Drops off a little bit with the Nuggets. Nuggets are 12 and uh, 12 and eight. Then it's the Sun. So then it's Nuggets, Suns, Grizzlies, Blazers, and Rockets. Warriors on the outside looking in. Spurs as well. Kings, Thunder, Mavs, Pelicans, Timberwolves. That would be hashtag good for the hobby. I think uh, Warriors getting into the playoffs with James Wiseman. That'd be hashtag good for the hobby. Love to see the Kings and like the seven or eight seed. That'd be good too. Show off Tyrese Halliburton and increase the stock of like De'Aaron Fox. That would be good. Mavericks, I think, are are, are stumbling a little bit. Eight and thirteen. That's not good. Still only a few games outside of a playoff spot at the moment. It's still very early in the season. We're only like twenty-ish games in, but. And the Pelicans are seven and twelve. I've heard rumors. Have you guys heard the rumors too, right? Pelicans are might actually be sellers if they don't really improve by whenever the deadline is this year. So JJ Redick may be on the move. Lonzo Ball may be on the move. Might not be a bad idea. They just kind of recreate a team around around Zion. There's Lamelo Ball for Charlotte, Matthew Shira. Lamelo has been playing some good basketball. Maybe Alonzo Melo reunion could be interesting. That could be. Quickly again. And we've got Daniel Oturo. Hot Signatures Rookie. Clippers. That's going to go to EA and the Clip Show. And the Knicks, once again, Eddie Romero. Logging in all these quicklies and toppings and whatnot. Timberwolves, Nicholas with the T Wolves. Be topping. I'm telling you, New, New York Knicks in the playoffs would be hashtag good for the hobby.
Danny Avija is supposed to have some upside too. I think he's been either injured or maybe coming off COVID list or something like that, but it's for the for the Washington Wizards. We'll save one of these. Austin, all of those will go to you anyway. We'll set one of those aside. It's supposed to be an Israeli player. He's got some pro experience already overseas. So that, that experience could definitely definitely help the, the Wizards. We've got some players. I know they're not their record is only four and thirteen. That's the worst in basketball right now, but I think the idea is those young players will finally click at some point with him and Hachimura. Elijah Hughes, CJ behind him. Oh, that, was, that Tatum was numbered. And we've got an autograph here. All right, so we've got a couple things going on here. We've got Jason Richardson. Nice for the Warriors. That's for Joe. And we've got that number, Jason Tatum, 109 out of 199 for the Celtics, Jonathan. Another Halliburton down here as well. Nice. Two boxes to go. Another five boxes in the store, ladies and gentlemen. Check it out. Make it happen. This is the last, this is the first five boxes of our final case of hoops. We don't have any more after that. I know, Warriors are cruising in this break, Ramon. Good luck, boys and girls. Next box. Looks like a couple spots picked up already in the next five boxes. So let's keep chipping away at that. Let's see about a dozen orders coming in. So we're, we're two boxes away from being done. Maybe another 15, 20 minutes or so we'll be, we'll be done with this break. So keep your orders coming so I can go through a bunch of orders and see what we can do right after this break. Do the Bucks reach the finals this year? I mean, that's, that's the goal every year for every team, right? But the Bucks specifically with a player of Giannis's caliber. It's good for the hobby. Ooh, okay, thank you. List.
There he is right here. I mean, at some point we gotta we gotta expect him to get to the finals. But what do the what do they need to do to get over the hump? Is Drew Holiday enough? Be hashtag good for the hobby and good for the game to see Giannis in the NBA Finals. And we got Jaden McDaniels is your autograph, your rookie ink auto for the Timberwolves. Nicholas. Got another Tyrese Halliburton out here. And all of these rookies are worth, especially the ones that, that you're more familiar with, definitely looking up. I'm sure they have some great value. Even some of the ones that are not so familiar still might be holding some secret good value. Basketball market's pretty strong in general. Hey, there's the mellow ball. That'll be for Matthew Shira and Charlotte. Trey Jones, there's another quickly. It was also pretty good. Knicks, Eddie Romero. A couple of rookie cards right here. Anthony Edwards and Sadiq Bey. Colin Sexton, number to 199. Paul Anthony, Josh Green. And obviously all rookies are going to ship. And I'm going to try to catch as many of the sort of bigger name rookies right here. But there's we're, we also have a list of rookies that we're going we're gonna to have top loaded. Everything is going to be at least sleeved rookie card wise. But there's a big list of players that will be also top loaded by our sorting and shipping team before this all this goes out. Anthony Edwards, Cole Anthony, Avija, Danny, Devin Vassell, Quickly, Okoro, Wiseman, Ball, Toppin, so on and so forth. I'm going to try to catch at least half of these. Uh, Okongwu, Patrick Williams, Pritchard, Sadiq Bey, Theo Maladon, Tyrese Halliburton, Tyrese Maxey. Well, just in the interest of time, we can't do all of that here. We got other breaks that we need to knock out, but you know, we'll try to catch as much of these guys as possible. Avija goes to Austin, and this purple parallel of Okongwu will be for Atlanta. Robert Runkle. Design, right? I don't know why this looks so. I think this looks cool. All right, see you, Mike. See you tomorrow. It's R.J. Barrett, Colin Sexton. Obviously, these numbered cards will be top loaded as well. Got out of 99, DeAndre Hunter. And we've got we've got this dick right here. Dick Barnett. Hoops Inc. autograph. Old school basketball player Eddie Romero with the Knicks.
Wiseman, of course, goes to Joe Parisi and the Golden State Warriors. All right, final box, ladies and gentlemen. Give myself a little more room here. Good luck. All right, let's get an update on scores in our final box here in the third quarter. Four minutes in, left in the third quarter. Sixers up 80-67 to 67 on the Charlotte Hornets. We're watching the, the ESPN game is Pacers at Bucks. Bucks up 88-61 with 6.26 left in the third quarter. At halftime, Hawks have the slight edge on the Dallas Mavericks 56-53. I was going to say, the, the Hawks, I feel like, have to be on the cusp of of breaking out already. Uh, Trey Young, I love. John Collins is solid too. Now they got they got some, you know, they got some other guys. They got some guys like DeAndre Hunter, right? Cam Reddish. They've got some draft picks, some assets. A Kongwu. You know, put all those guys together. If they click at some point, that could be a scary team. You know, maybe a little trade, maybe a, a free agent addition. Then all of a sudden, in a weaker East, Hawks could be a scary team, like a team that you kind of don't want to face in the first round kind of team. And maybe maybe beyond. Trendsetter, hello. I have a question. Yes, what, what is your question? How many spots are left in the Super Bowl mixture to try to win an additional spot? I think it says in the title, doesn't it? I think I, I think it says in the title. Check the title, Aaron. Trey Jones, there's quickly again. Anthony Edwards. All right, Anthony Edwards goes to Nicholas and the T Wolves. And the quickly, of course, goes to. The Knicks, Eddie. We were looking at Rookie of the Year odds. This guy actually had some, I think, some decent value on the on the money line there. Enough to maybe put coffee money on there, breakfast money. Oh, there he is. Rookie Inc. Emmanuel quickly. Eddie Romero with the New York Knicks. He's been looking pretty good.
That's a numbered Tyrese Halliburton. And that is one, uh, that's 66 out of 199. Nice one, Austin. Uh, Samuel wants that, uh, that quickly autograph, Eddie, if you're in the chat. I was watching quickly whatever game he was playing a couple nights ago, maybe Sunday or Monday night. And I was just kind of half watching that game. And I, out of the corner of my eye, I see someone slashing, making plays, shooting shots. I was like, oh, look at that, that R.J. Barrett out there. No, it turned out to be quickly. I was like, oh, quickly, interesting. It's only half watching. I was like, oh, I started paying attention a little bit more. He looked pretty good. Tyler Spaulding will pay even more for that quickly autograph. There's Eddie. No way, he says. He's like, that's mine, boys. No thanks. Yeah, I mean, he's got a. If he can get close, if he wins Rookie of the Year, I guess he's got a shot. The value of that would definitely go up. Another Tyrese Halliburton. And another Lamelo Ball right here too. There's LaMelo for Charlotte, Matthew Shira. Another Tyrese Halliburton for the Kings, Austin. We've got Udoka, Azubuke. Nine out of 15. I think that's the best I'm going to do. There he is again. That's the best I'm going to do with that. That's for Utah. And there's Isaac Bonga. Hot signatures for the Wizards, Austin, with Washington, D.C., the district. This VIP with Kawhi Leonard, a couple other players right here. And the out of 10 for the Jazz, Sean Maddock with this one. And there you have it, boys and girls. That's five box, random team break number five from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Number six is in the store. The next five boxes, be sure to get in on it because that is the last case. We're working on the last case right now that we have in the shop. Will we get more? We're going to try. But will it be at the same friendly price point that is at, at now? I hope so, but I, I wouldn't hold my breath. Generally, when we re-up on these cases, and personals went through a ton of cases too, when we re-up on these cases, they're generally a little bit, if the price has gone up, it would be a little bit higher. Maybe it hasn't. I don't know. We'll find out. Nice Halliburton autograph and, of course, the Steph Curry autograph that no one reacted to. I thought it was cool, though. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Five box Ram Team 5 in the books. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.